This is PSPICE simulation tutorial series. In this video, we will learn how to do temperature analysis for a simple thermostat circuit. So let's get started. In the first step, we are going to open ORCAD capture using Cadence program menu. Select the license file and click over OK button. Once the ORCAD capture is ready, we can create new project. To do that, we'll go to file, new and click over project button. Let's name it temperature analysis and we are going to save it on desktop select the folder make sure you have enabled the pspice simulation and click over ok button now in the next step it will ask you want to create a pspice project using some previously or existing template or you want to create a blank project in our case we'll create a blank project and add all the components and circuit components manually click over ok button now now once the project has been created, we are going to add components. To do that, we'll go to Place, Components. First search for Register. We'll select General Purpose Register. Right click and click over Place button. We'll place it somewhere here. And later we will make few more copies of these registers. Then we'll place Potentiometer. We'll search Part, right click, Place. We'll place it somewhere here. Next we are going to select a couple of diodes so first will be d1 and 4148 right click and click over place button and then next we are going to add one short key diode which will be d1 and 821 hit enter right click place after that we are going to add one opam which will be AD741. And then we are going to add some DC power supplies, which will be VDC. Right click, place. So these are all the components we are going to use in this schematic. Now I'm going to create the schematic quickly. Once the schematic have been created, we are going to create new simulation profile. To do that, we'll click over create new simulation profile button. Let's name it temp analysis and click over create button. Now in the simulation setting, make sure you have selected the analysis type to DC sweep analysis. Sweep variable will be temperature and start value 0 to 100 with the increment of 1 degree Celsius. Make sure you have selected linear here and click over apply and OK. Now we are going to run the simulation and examine the output. To do that, we'll click over run the simulation button. Here we go. So as you can see, the simulation have been done successfully. Now we are going to plot the output, which is our V1 waveform. To do that, we'll click over add trace button and we'll select VV1 and click over OK. So as you can see, with increasing the temperature from zero to 100 degrees Celsius, how V1 is varying. For more tutorials, visit us at resources.emaeda.com and don't forget to like and subscribe our YouTube channel.